Developing the Bronx, eight people have been arrested at a home in the Norwood section of the Bronx. Guns and drugs were found in the same room as a seven-year-old child. Police say the people were squatting in that home. Eyewitness News reporter Sonia Rincon live in the Norwood section right now. Sonia, good afternoon. Good afternoon, Michelle. Yeah, eight migrants under arrest and now facing charges after police responded to a call here on Hull Avenue last week. The police found guns, drugs, and a child inside the basement of this home right across from a school, a home the migrants were living in as squatters. This surveillance video obtained by Eyewitness News shows police moving in. They were responding to a call about a man with a gun. They chased one man into the basement. He's identified as 24-year-old Hector de Souza Villalta, believed to be a migrant from Venezuela. A second man, identified as 22-year-old Javier Alborno, tries to flee but is arrested. Police say he also had a gun. Four of eight suspects arrested here on Hull Avenue last week can be seen here with police walking them out. They are facing weapons, drugs, and child endangerment charges because police say there was a seven-year-old child staying with them. Since then, the NYPD says six of them have been released, including one already charged in another case. Two of the people with the guns had open cases, one for attempted murder in Yonkers and one walking around with an open gun indictment walking around. After obtaining a search warrant, police say they recovered two more loaded guns and ammunition, as well as drugs, including ketamine mixed with cocaine. A neighbor tells us the landlord has been struggling with squatters. And you didn't know who was staying there or not staying there. And, you know, the owner of the building had a hell of a time trying to get them out. You know, how they got in, I don't know. But once they were in, because of New York City's laws regarding squatters, he couldn't get him out without going through the, the legal process. Yeah, the suspects are now out of this house. Only two of them are being held in jail. The rest released without bail, despite the Bronx DA asking for bail for them. Several of the suspects are also under invest investigation for robberies, including a robbery pattern in Bergen County. Live in Norwood, the Bronx, Sonia Rincon, Channel 7, Eyewitness News.